apologize. That's such a great idea. We have to do this more often. Seriously. Crack, crack, crackle, crack, pop. Feed the fire, guys. Feed the fire. Crackle, pop, Let snack, it burn. Probble, crackle, pop. <laughs> pop. Crack. Ah. Oh anyway, God. guys, let's sing a song. How about not? Yeah, baby, let's do this. Shut up. What are you doing? Is that necessary? Yes, it is. Shut up. My God. God. Where? <laughs> anyway, guys. You just spat in my mouth. Do I look like I care? Guys. <gasps> We're telling scary stories. Fine, then. Let's tell scary stories. Everybody, shut up. This is scary. Oh, my God. Okay, one time, there was this girl named Kim. And she like lived in the peace country, and she walked in her. <laughs> Isn't it funny? Not funny. I'm sorry. Okay. A deer bit her fingers off. That's oh my gross. god! What? Yeah, that's what I mean by scary story. Guys. You know what? That wasn't even scary. You want to hear yeah, a that scary was, story? That was kind of lame, actually. This one time at band camp. Oh my. So we like. <laughs> This is one time at bank. It's <laughs> like the biodiversity of like something or rather, and it was just like so intense. It like came up and it was like so cool. Oh my god, guys. Okay, like, nobody knows what you're talking about, Quinn. What are you talking about? Seriously, nobody can understand what the hell you're saying. Well, let's see you try what? a better story. Okay, I got a real scary story, and you know what the cool thing about it is? It actually happened. Sure, okay. here. So this is a Celtic legend, and so my Uncle Jasper was telling us this. We were camping, and he told me this guy, he lived, I think it was like the 1800s in Ireland or something, and so he had this gorgeous wife, and his landlord wanted the wife, and so... He used to just like sit outside the window and just like watch <coughs> her brush her hair, wash her, you know, like put on her lotion. It was kind of creepy and mm, odd. But the husband it. had no idea what was going on. Clearly. And then one oh day, my God. he just That's crashed through the window. Mm. He crashed That's through the window. Well, this is scary. so intense. And he just stole her. That's sweet. And so this guy, he didn't know. He, he since now, like he, he has no idea what happened to his wife. And so legend is... That he never died because his soul could never rest until he found his wife. So he goes around, his wife w loved to camp, and so he tries to look for girls he thinks might be his wife. He hasn't given up, and you know, he just he goes around finding them, and turns out he's not even in love with her anymore. He just kind of eats them, <laughs> hence the name Cannibal oh my God, Larry. That's, gross. that's yeah. really close to cannibalism. Yeah, like the cannibal. Like you mean like Hannibal Lecter? Hannibal the cannibal guy? I don't know what cannibalism means. What does it mean? Really? Um, people eating people. Ew! Ew. 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 Oh my god. That's, That's disgusting. Oh my god, that is like so gross. Like people's eyes. Ew. They probably Ew. leave those. I was actually reading a book about it. You know, they they actually leave the brain and the eyes, but they use the um the brain to tan their clothes and stuff. But um yeah, they like I don't know, they like fry their skin. And just, it's not that good for you, but I guess like if you're gonna do it, you might as well do it right. But. Well, anyway, guys, let's just. I hear there's like a cave nearby, guys, and I still want to go like the biodiversity of like whatever she was talking about. It'll be like so cool. Anyway.